Good morning, Titans. Today is Wednesday, September 4th, and you're here with your host, Amanda. Please rise for your national anthem. Morning, Titans, and happy Wednesday. Titans, my one-year-old son, Jeremiah, is walking like a madman. He walks everywhere, and he's getting into trouble constantly. He's always reaching for things, grabbing things, sharp things, electrical outlets, things that can hurt him. <laughs> he's going everywhere, and he's just exploring the world right now. And as his dad, I'm constantly following him and removing his hand and removing objects from him to protect him, because he doesn't know any better right now. He's only one. But oftentimes when I do that, he'll immediately start to kind of fuss and cry, walk away and pout, and he'll be like, Dad, why are you ruining my fun? I'm just trying to explore. But he looks at me like I'm ruining his life, and he doesn't get what I'm trying to do as his dad. And I just was reflecting this morning in the chapel about how often myself, I, when things don't go right, and when things that I'm expecting to go a certain way go a different way, I can often turn to God and like, what are, where are you, man? Like, what are you doing? Why don't you care? Like, why aren't you doing something about this? I can act like my one-year-old son towards God. And I think that's common, that sometimes we don't see God's ways, and we don't see that everything he does is because he loves us, and he's striving to protect us and to keep us out of harm's way. So my reflection this morning is that we can maybe not be one-year-olds towards God, but strive to be mature and trust in our relationship that God is always looking out for us in everything he does. If you can join me in prayer this morning. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good and loving Father, we ask that you help us to experience your presence, your true, true presence, the love that you have for us, so that we can come to know you, and trust you, and believe in you more and more. And so ultimately, everything that comes our way, we can turn to you and put, place our life into your hands, trusting that you will always guide us correctly. We offer all this up to you in your Son's most holy name. Amen. And with the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. There is a very important meeting for all boys interested in trying out for the junior boys soccer team today at lunch in Mr. Sulio's room, room 253. Students who wish to try out for the Holy Trinity's golf team are asked to sign up on the sheet outside of the phys ed office. Mr. Martineau and Ms. Edge will have more info regarding tryouts by the end of the week. Attention color leaders, please remember to visit your ho color homerooms for the last 10 minutes of period one today to let students know what color they are and explain that fun lies ahead of them at color night. Grade 12 teachers, please release your color leaders from period one at 9.55 a.m. so they can visit their color homerooms. Norfolk County is organizing an open mic night for students 13 to 18 years of age on Friday, September 20th from 7 to 9 p.m. Please see the information posted in Student Services for more details. And finally, a quick message from the cafeteria. Come into the caf and enjoy our delicious supervisor special. Thank you and we appreciate your business. That's all for me. Now over to Mr. C. 
Morning Titans and welcome to uh, the second day of uh, school for this year. Hope everyone had an awesome first day. Uh, the day ran extremely smoothly and I want to thank everyone for their patience and help and support yesterday in, trying to, in making the day run so smoothly in many different areas of the school. A uh, special thank you to Students Council. Uh, they wore the gray shirts yesterday and helped a lot of our new students out. A huge thank you to our secretarial and custodial teams for having the school in perfect condition for us to start the year yesterday. And a big huge thank you to Mr. Nicholson who came in uh, during a summer vacation, was out weed -wise Whacking, uh, the gardens and trimming the trees and made the place look great outside so a huge thank you to Mr. Nicholson and finally a huge thank you to HTTV having announcements on the very first day up and running is a huge undertaking and we really support that our announcements are a key way to get information out for the day and it's an important part of our day so I want to thank everyone at HTTV under the leadership of Mr. Yeoman I uh, have some late breaking sports announcements. If you're interested in playing on our football team this year, tryouts start tomorrow, uh, Thursday after school. All you need to bring is phys ed wear and just show up in the gym and then you'll go out to the field. No experience is necessary. It's a great sport, great way to get involved in school. So if you want to try out for the football team, tryouts start tomorrow after school, uh, meet in the gym. Uh, also, uh, the tennis, if you want to play tennis, tennis sign-up sheets are now available outside Phys Ed. Please sign up if you're interested in playing on our tennis team. Uh, this week, we have a, uh, for the next couple days, pretty busy. This morning is a busy morning as we have our grade level assemblies. Uh, we're going to start with our grade 12s at the beginning of period 1, followed by our grade 11s. Then period 2, which are grade 10s, followed by our grade 9s. Classes will be called down. Uh, so that's this morning. Uh, tomorrow is photo day. Please make sure you bring uh, any uh, paperwork. If you want photos, you don't necessarily need the paperwork, but we need you to uh, be in full uniform and get your photo taken uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow is also our grade nine orientation activities during period one. So looking forward to that as our grade nines become more familiar with our school. And Friday, of course, is our spirit wear day where you can replace a uniform part with HT spirit wear. So that's the plan for the rest of the week. Hope everyone has a great day and we'll see you at the grade level assemblies. Thank you.